Good morning. What is up, YouTube? How's everyone doing today? Greetings and salutations. Hope you guys are all having a fantastic day so far, night, whatever time you guys are watching this. Um, but today is going to be another episode of the vlog. Um, it's about 8 a.m. and I am late again for the Veterans Thrift on Tuesday. So I'm heading over there right now. Then we're going to go to the Goodwill afterwards. Um, and yeah, I'm super duper excited. Uh, hopefully we can find some treasures today. I haven't been to the Veterans Thrift in a few days. And I also really want to see if that leather chair is still at the Goodwill. Um, I wasn't able to get it yesterday. That was the plan. But uh, I totally forgot that we were going to be going to... Um, Legoland so oh and if you didn't see that Legoland video check it out we went yesterday it was so much fun um, but yeah so let's go to the store right now check it out and oh, say a little prayer for me I hope that chair is still there because I really do want it but you know if it's not there then it wasn't meant to be and yeah you know you can't you can't live with too much regret you know especially if it's just a thrift store but anyway let's head out and check it out all right you guys handbag time $14.96 for this Michael Kors. Oh, it's blue. I think this is gonna be like 75% off. Ooh, look at this. Bueno, $5. This yellow, Juni, and Burke. Where's the tag for this guy? Oh, this white bag is kind of cute. Zuron. It's a brand of that. Trying to go through everything pretty quickly. There's a ton of people here today, so. Not like last Tuesday, which for some reason was really slow on a Tuesday, so I'm just like, oh my gosh. Dia Nia. What is this? Halogen. I like that strap thing on it. Oh, this is cute. Only four bucks. Sold. Ooh, this is interesting. I like that texture, but it's leather. What is this guy? Steve Madden. I'm on the other side of the handbags. The bags have been like picked over super intensely. I'm surprised they even found what I have right now. But you can tell when the hand when the handbags look jumbled like this that there have been a lot of people going over them. Big Buddha. I got this juicy couture fabric bag. $35. Yes. This one's a Steve Madden. Madison West. Someone wanted me to get this clutch. And it's still here. So I'm going to grab it. I'm super excited about that. Lacoste. Ooh, there's some new Chanel flats. I wonder if those are authentic. Oh my gosh, I'm so dead. There's those too. You guys, look how cute this Burberry jacket is. It's size 12, it's 250. Look at that, that is so cute. All right, you guys, I just left the store. I got a couple goodies. I didn't get the shoes because I'm waiting to hear back from my friend to see if they're authentic. And then I'll come back because then they'd be worth it. But I had $100 a piece 
a little much. All right, you guys, it's the moment of truth. Oh, I'm so nervous. Like, <laughs> I don't even know why I'm nervous, but I'm hoping that the chair is still there. Oh, man, I'm crying. That black sofa is still there. And it's behind the black sofa. I remember that for sure. <sighs> oh my god, it's still there. 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 <gasps> and no one spotted it. It's still here. I'm gonna buy it right now. Oh my god, you guys. I just got really excited. It's mine. I can't wait to clean this up. It's gonna be such a fun restoration process. <sighs> can't wait. Okay, and the ottoman is still here that matches with it. I'm gonna go put it next to it and then just like see how it looks. But this one's $10. Oh my gosh. Do I really want the ottoman? I don't know. I don't know if I'll have space for it in my room, but it's $10. Uh, oh, there's a pen mark on it. Of course, of all the things, there's a pen mark on the ottoman. But it's like on the very bottom. Hey, look at these chunky coach shoes. Okay, anyway, let's look at the handbags really quick. I didn't look at any of the handbags in the front. In the entrance, I have my ticket in my pocket, so the, the chair is completely mine. I'm gonna get it, I'm so... Oh, you know what? I didn't check to see if they still had those bookcases. I think Dad was like all for it when I told him about it, but Mom was like, well, where are you gonna put those? And I was like, well, I'm gonna put them in the garage eventually and then just use them as storage. But I don't know if she's into it, so I might not even get them, but... Um, She's like, we should clean out the garage first, which she's totally right about. So, you know, mom's always no best. Plus, I really have nowhere to put it anyway. So, I don't want to get it and then have nowhere to put it. Why are those Steve Madden shoes right there? They're so damaged on the side. Um, I think that's a coach. Like, that light blue one is actually kind of pretty. I like the color of it. Juicy Couture stuff. No new bags right here. Is this a white tag? No, it's a green tag. You guys, look at this clutch. It's actually really pretty. It's a Banana Republic clutch. All right, I'm just looking through the rest of the handbags, but honestly, there's nothing that I haven't already seen. Oh, see, look at that, how that folds back. That is totally fake. Which is unfortunate. Because it kind of would have been cute if it was real. And for some reason, like, sometimes they'll make, like, pretty good fakes of, like, other brands. And then, like, other fakes for other brands, like, I feel like every Michael Kors fake that I've ever seen is horrible like so bad oh how cute is this little mickey mouse pouch for 3.99 what do we have here perlina tommy hilfiger nine west Oh, this fossil bag is still here. A pleather backpack. Let's check out the shoes and see if there's anything cool for the kids. Hey 
Hey you guys, check out these Clark. They're actually pretty nice. They're like really worn right there on that one corner, but I mean, like it kind of looks funny from the back, but no one's ever really gonna see that because it's gonna be like on the floor. Um, but I like the color of them and I like the leather. I'm trying on the shoes. I kind of like them. But then I'm down here and I just saw these little coach shoes. $14.99. How much are these though? Do they have a price on them? Oh, they're $9.99. How do they look? Okay, I'm looking. Oh my gosh, stop. You can put eggs in here too, just like the other one that I got. I actually gave it to my aunt. This one's super cute though, because it's copper. But, it's not as cute as the other teapot one. And what I really want is a wired chicken. I think it would be really cute. Oh, also, I'm looking for that monkey that was like dressed as a nurse statue, because someone wanted me to buy it for them. And I don't see, oh, you know what? I, oh, oh my gosh, she's right here. Oh, but is that okay that her lip is broken? The person that wanted it, let me know. I don't remember who it was. <laughs> Cause I'm, yeah, let me know. Hopefully you're watching this video, but her mouth is like chipped right there, which is really sad. Oh, that little cat. Oh my gosh, it's a collection of bears and little angels. Oh my gosh. How cute are these little tchotchkes right now? I think my favorite though is this little dog. Oh, what is he? he I think like something, oh, I think it's supposed to come with like a bone and then it sticks to his mouth. That's cute. Oh, these salt and pepper shakers? They're kind of cute looking, to be honest. Ah, uh, that little cow. Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm so excited for my chair. But to be honest, I feel like the adrenaline's worn off and like now I'm like, hmm, should I get it? <laughs> but like, obviously I have to get it. But I really wanna fix it up. And I'm gonna use it kind of like a desk chair. Like I know it's big for a desk, but like, you know what? I spend a lot of time sitting down there. So like I wanna be super comfy and that chair is beyond comfortable. And the thing that I love most about my desk is that I can like move it up and down so I can adjust the height. So it'll be perfect even if the sofa or even if that chair is like pretty bulky. Should still work out. And that's the reason why I'm like hesitant about getting the stool thing because like the footrest. Because am I ever really going to use the footrest? I don't know. Oh, that's chipped right there. We got some snowboards. Rollerblades. Tennis rackets. <gasps> you know what? Someone told me that they found a Louis Vuitton tennis racket case, and that is amazing. That is so cool. I would love to see a, Louis, a vintage Louis Vuitton tennis racket case. I think that would be really fun. We have this Banana Republic black fabric tote right there. Sock monkey. <laughs> this folly, 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 folly bag is still here as well. BG. Hmm. Put that there. Oh, this little flipper. <laughs> okay, let's see what they have right here. In this little section. 
they have a bunch of well one i think they had other ones or was that it oh that's that fake michael kors bag we saw that the other day still here this little blue and white sandal caught my eye though you put like a little votive in here dollar 99 I'm kind of tempted to buy this O'Neal hat because I've been looking for another kind of like pool hat that I can wear in the pool because I don't like being in the pool without a hat. Well, look at these cats. This, is this, she's like, is she like the corpse bride or something or is this like something else? She kind of looks like what's her face from Nightmare Before Christmas, but I could be wrong. These little speedo things. Ooh, for the water, like water shoes. Looking okay, back to this hat, it is an O'Neill hat. So, it's made for like the water. It's not in horrible shape either. I mean, there's this little broken part right here. Oh no, that's gonna like just like start ripping out. Okay, nah. I don't want to just buy it for it to just fall apart in like a day. Ooh, a Sony battery. Ivanka Trump. This is like a fake long chump. I'm trying out the chair. It's so comfy. I even have like the little stool for my feet. This is where they're, you know, this isn't like a stain. This is probably like from their feet. I don't know. I don't think I'm going to get this. Because I feel like I would never actually use it. Or would I? Hmm. They still have the bookcases. The cabinets. Oh. Adrian, try and be strong. Ooh, they have one of these zebra prints. These are from Ikea. That's like the third time I think I've seen it in this actual store. You know, I think I forgot to show you guys this like little lamp thing. You know, it's like kind of cool. Like if you change the shade out, like this is like kind of like a cool, like, Side table slash <laughs> I found some more Michael Kors boots. The color of the week is white. Anything that you find with a white tag will be But it's like a little register. dongle thing. It's like missing Today is also Senior Tuesday. It's like a metal show your ID looking at the thing. register, you will receive an additional 15% uh, off your entire purchase. Oh, these toms are so we also have cute. Sheets at the Sorry I was talking over the announcement. I kind of like... Don't notice them anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Unless it's announcing that something's coming out. <laughs> okay, so I'm still thinking about these shoes. They're really cute. So I think I might get them. I really like them. Alright, you guys. I have the shoes on. I don't know, they look really long. But they're only nine and a half. So they feel comfy, but they make my feet look like clown feet. Okay, don't mind my ashy knees and ankles but like they look massive right Ugh. all right you guys i got it in i'm so excited i think it'll close too okay guys let's head home now i'm so excited got a chair hey right, guys just got to lowe's gonna buy some tape and also look at plants because you know i love them look at these they're plants i love them <laughs> Ooh, how pretty. Some ferns. Oh. I still kind of like these things. But do I really want one? I'm not sure. These are cute too. Oh, these are the ones that close up. <gasps> these are all over the Philippines. Look at that, look at them close. I have to get this for the kids. They're going to die. Oh my gosh. I love these. Oh, how exciting. I'm gonna make these all close. 
Wow! <laughs> oh my gosh, how fun! These are actually really pretty too, and I love the like the high white in these. And we actually we have like one of these upstairs in the loft, and it's like grown huge. We've had it for years, and I love it so much. Those plants are so hard to kill; <laughs> they like live forever. We barely even water it. Oh, they have more of those brain plants right there. They don't really have any other plants that I like, so definitely gonna get the sensitivity plant though. This one is so cool. I think I'm just gonna end up buying this tape. <laughs> it's okay if it stinks. Well, it's not that okay, but yeah. Would it be much to keep this guy inside the car because he's so cool? I can just go like this and then it moves. <laughs> Even like the le like the like the these like the stems like bend like it's so crazy. Alright you guys, I am actually back at the Veterans Thrift now. Got a message and the Chanel shoes are in fact authentic, so I'm gonna have to go inside and pick them up now. Alright, just got my shoes, let's go home. Alright you guys, we are back inside the car and oh my gosh, it has been such an amazing morning. Pottery barn chair, still there, waiting for me. Two pairs of authentic Chanel shoes, that clutch that someone wanted that was still there that I was super excited to be able to purchase for them. And like, oh my gosh, how lucky, like I'm so happy. So, I'm excited, let's go home now. I have a bunch of things I need to package and mail out. It's 11, ooh, it's like almost lunch. I haven't eaten anything, so I can maybe eat like a brunch or something when I get home. But let's go home and see what everyone's doing and Oh, maybe the kids are swimming. Oh, I don't know. It's really, really hot right now. It's like 96 degrees and the sun is like blistering and it's only getting hotter and hotter. Um, it was, it usually gets the hottest like around like two or three and it already started off warm this morning. It was already in the 80s and normally in the morning it's like around like the like 70s, uh, mid 70s. So it already started off pretty hot and last night when we got home from Legoland, it was already, it was still like 86, 86 seven degrees so it didn't even really cool down too much so I know this week is gonna be really hot uh, I know in a few days it's gonna be in the triple digits again and yeah it's gonna be crazy anyway let's go home also cannot forget about this plant it's so cool it reminds me of when we were in the Philippines like with my family these vlogs are actually up there like um, even the vlogs when I saw these plants with my dad on my mom's family coconut farm so cool now I have the like a piece of the Philippines with me I cannot like it's so cool they are uh I can't wait to show the kids I'm so excited all right you guys the mom is dead for the shoes unfortunately they don't fit her so they're gonna go up in the shop but I'm very excited about them um clean up the house a little bit we're having some surprise guests come over and right now I'm kind of looking for a vase or like a little planter for this guy because I need one. Um, I'm tr I think I just got one recently, but I don't know where. I think they went outside. Did I put them outside already? No, they're not. Oh, no, 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 no. I have them in my room because I haven't did a haul on them yet. Okay. Anyway, I'm going to look for something to put that guy in because it's so cute. You want to see something magical, mystical, and mysterious? Yeah. Come here. Do you see that plant? Mm -hmm. Touch the leaves right there. Which one? Look at touch it. They're gonna close right there. Look at. <gasps> touch the whole thing. It's <gasps> cool. All right, guys. So we are. We're actually kind of like in the library slash hallway of the house. It's kind of like in the middle of the night, but I wanted to film the ending for today's video. So when I got home from thrifting, um, we kind of had like surprise guests come over. Our mom's friends came over for like uh, our family friends all the way from New York. Um, they were visiting and it's kind of spur of the moment thing. They weren't uh, sure if they were going to be able to make it. And then they came over and it was so much fun. I'm um, going to catch up, ate a lot of food because mom can whip up. So much food in just like five minutes like it's amazing and i'm sorry i didn't film any of it but it was kind of just like 
a whirlwind kind of thing. And now it's the end of the night. I managed to get John to help me get my sofa, or my sofa, my chair into the house. So here it is. It is amazing, you guys. Like truly amazing. Look at me. Oh. Look at it. Oh, it's so good. I cannot wait to like fix it up and stuff. I think it's gonna look so, so good. But um, right now I'm gonna show you guys the rest of the stuff that I did end up getting from Veteran Surf today. And oh, today was just like a thrifting day of epic proportions. Like literally three Holy Grail items found and it's like amazing. Um, but one of them is this clutch. And I went back to get this for Judy. Judy, I'm so excited that this clutch was still there today. It's so gorgeous. It's, um, forget the brand. It's Vasilis Emanuel Zulias. I think, like, that's how, I don't know how to pronounce it. I can't pronounce anything. So, um, it's so beautiful. It's snakeskin leather, and it's in amazing condition, and it's so gorgeous. Stunning. And then, of course, this Pottery Barn chair that I got from the Goodwill for just $50. Oh, and it was so nice that so many of you guys agreed that I should get it because I was like, what if everyone says no? And I told them that I would do what they said. And um, a good amount, I think like seven, I'm going to look actually right now. It was like 70 something percent of you guys said that I should get it. And that was like very exciting. Ah, it was 74% of you guys, so that is amazing. Um, so of course I had to get it. There was also um, the matching ottoman. Let me know if I should get it. I, I, still, I should have asked, I think I'll ask you guys whether or not I should get it. Um, hopefully it'll still be there if you guys say yes. It was only $10, but like, I just know that those weird stains on there are like weird foot stains. I'm just like... Like, am I gonna have to spray it with, like, disinfectant? Like, <laughs> like I mean, like, the rest of the chair, I feel like it's, I don't know. I don't know. But, I have, like, so many ideas for this chair. I don't think I want to dye it now that I got it into the house and I see it in the actual light. I want to preserve the color as much as I can. And I really don't mind it has, like, some, like, weird, like, some, like, discoloration just because that's kind of, like, the nature of a leather chair. I kind of want it to look kind of, like, lived in and aged and beautiful. And I really love the golden color of this chair already. And this is actually the color, like, if I got this chair, this is probably the color I would get it in. Because you guys know that this is my favorite color in handbags as well. And it's my favorite color of leather in general. So I just love it so much. I just want to clean it and condition it because some of the parts are a little bit... Um, like darkened and hopefully I can get them lighter with just a little bit of conditioning and cleaning so we'll see how that goes um, but it's definitely going to be a project and it's definitely going to be really exciting once I can get it restored to kind of its old glory you know but it's still gorgeous like it has really good bones and the Manhattan um, leather chair from Pottery Barn is such an, like, an iconic piece from them they've had it since I worked there years and years ago and they still have it to this day so very excited, um, but now to the two other, like, holy grail, OMG, I can't believe I found this moments from today, and I can't believe I just left them, because, okay, I, I thought, like, you know when you see these things, it's too good to be true, and at being priced at $100 each, like, I didn't want to just, like, buy them, and then they weren't even authentic anyway, and it's just, like, but luckily, I have a friend who is really, really great at authenticating Chanel, and they gave me a thumbs up and so I was able to procure this is the first set and this is the Chanel Ballet Cap Toe Patent Flat gorgeous it's in the black patent leather and then it has the um, like tannish off whitish color toe cap and these are in fantastic condition um, barely look used at all there is a little bit like a very, very slight um, color transfer right here. And it's I know it's from this little, like the little um, string from there, but it's like, honestly, like you can't even tell because the bow goes over it anyway. And it just kind of looks like a shadow, which there is already a shadow there. And there's like a slight discoloration right there. And there's like very light, very light marks, just like striations on the side, just from like 
regular just wear and tear, but it's like, it's mostly like right here. Is it popping up? Yeah, like on the inner corners, but honestly, it's like not even that big of a deal. Like you can't even tell that they're there. There's that, and then those were a size 38. Those are still available. I actually posted them up in the shop already because people have been asking about the Chanel shoes since I posted them on Instagram. So if you guys don't already follow me on Instagram, you guys have to because um, I have been trying to do like trying to show things a lot on there as well as I'm thrifting and let people like kind of like shop from there. And so I want to like be able to have it there and then have it in the shop. And these, um, the next pair I'm going to show you have actually sold already, and they're going to be packed up and sent out, but it is, um, they are these Chanel espadrilles, and this is the newer style because it has, like, the double stack, um, of the, I forgot what this is called, the espadrille thing, <laughs> but these are, like, seriously so stinking cute, they're so nice, it's in the gray suede and then the interior is the lambskin the bottoms are in great shape just have like a little bit of like markings right there but other than that they are in great shape the suede itself is spectacular and the shoe is just so so stinking cute and i never thought i'd find like real authentic chanel espadrilles at the thrift store and lo and behold they came to me. So I am very excited. Mom is really sad because neither one of these shoes fit her. But um, one day we're going to find Mom a pair and she's going to be so excited. Like I already know it. But so stinking cute. Oh gosh. I love them. I almost like, I was like, you know what? If they don't sell, it's okay. Like I just want them to like look at. And I'm just going to put them on my shoe rack next to the door and they're going to look really cute. But um, these are already sold. Um, the other ones are still available if anyone is interested, but I think that's we're going to end the video here, but I did want to do the shout out today for our thrift finds of the day um, that you guys comment and you guys please comment on um, new things that you guys have found because I love hearing about them. Um, oh, also. I asked you guys where Donna Buckman is from, and um, Megan Damastiso, I think that's what it's called, or the, what's their what their name is on YouTube. Uh, Donna Buckman is a Kohl's brand, so I did not know that, so that is good to know. I did not know they sell that Kohl's. Um, and I'm also so glad that you guys enjoyed the vlog from yesterday at um, Legoland. That was so, so fun. I uh, love Legoland so much. I haven't been there in forever and the kids really wanted to go, especially Cade. And he was just so, 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 so excited about it. Um, so thank you guys for coming along and I'm glad you guys liked it. Uh, hopefully I can take you guys on some more trips like that soon because it was pretty fun filming and Eliza actually really likes watching that video. He's like been watching it all day and he's just like, oh my gosh, Legoland. So... Um, okay, so Flor Ag Aguirre, Aguirre um, said, Just got home from errands and thrifting. Got six tops and dresses. Zara, Madewell, and three people, all $5 each. And that is amazing. Congratulations, Flor. I cannot believe you got those dresses for just $5 each because I believe the dresses in my Goodwills that I shop at, I think, they, like, I think the cheapest store sells them at like $9.99. And I know like each Goodwill is like different because I've gone to Goodwills in the same like region or district or whatever they're called and their pricing for clothing is like vastly different so five dollars is really cheap so congratulations that is awesome um, and I think that's all oh this is really cute too Grandma Gaga 60 said oh and grandma gaga you are amazing you are so sweet i love reading your comments and i'm sorry i don't always get a reply to them but I, I try to reply to them as much as i can and you are such an amazing person you're so sweet and so kind and she said when you were looking at the seed madden gold cross body with a stud hardware i was thinking that the bag was too small for my use but the strap was fabulous right like i i always think that too and sometimes i will buy a bag just for the strap 
That opens my mind up to searching for purses with great straps to add on to bags even if I don't love the purse it's on as well as we all know how expensive decorative long straps are to buy separately. And that is so true especially because it is so in and on trend right now to buy like cool decorative straps to add on to your handbags and it's just like a fun whimsical way to kind of express yourself and also to add more interest to your handbag and your outfit so i think that is amazing and that is going to end the video thank you guys again so much for watching today i cannot believe still that like this chair and i told myself like because i i already like i totally forgot that yesterday we were going to um legoland and i was like okay well i'm just gonna come back the next day to buy the chair like it was already in my head that i was gonna get it and then i was and then i came back and then mom was like oh like we're gonna leave tomorrow at 7 a.m da, da, da. and i was like oh my gosh i totally forgot so then i was like okay well i can't get the chair then i told myself it was still there and if you guys wanted if you guys like um wanted me to get it and it was like a like if the ratio was um more positive than negative for buying it then i would totally get it if it was still there and lo and behold it was so it was complete fate and now i'm just like thinking about the ottoman that i didn't get and i'm just like okay maybe i should get it right so let me know down below in the comments what you guys think because i think i might just go back and get it it's ten dollars um if anything like i can put a tray on it or put like kind of like a blanket on it with a tray that would be really cute kind of cover it up decorate um and i'm pretty sure like hopefully we can just clean it up you know but Thank you guys again so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you guys did, please give the video a big thumbs up. That always helps immensely. Don't forget to subscribe. Check out this morning's thrifting video. And the new video goes up tomorrow bright and early at 7 a.m. And the vlog goes up at 2. I love you guys so much. See you guys later. Bye. Oh, they have steamers. Toys. Cupcake. Step and learn scout.